today with the big help of uh, the guys at Hidden History. Big, big shout out to those guys for making this happen. We've come today to a very little known uh, ARP shelter, public ARP shelter, um, underneath a very well known coastal town. Um, we're going to start making our way through. I'm on a limited time period, so I'm going to have to film and photograph as I go through. So uh, please forgive me for the way it's shot. Um, well, I'm also using a different camera today. Hopefully that'll be all right. So let's go. So we'll start making our way through. Um, now, some of the other guys have come down with R further down the tunnel system already. Uh, straight away we can see blast balls. Let's keep going through. I'm still blind from looking into that camera. I'm not sure whether this cabling is original. It may well be actually, no. Wow, that's amazing. Check that out. Okay, I'll keep going through. Got to remember to angle this properly. There's a lovely tunnel on this. Let's get a bit more distance on this. Wow. So, as you can probably tell by its construction, this was a this was a private venture. This was not government funded. Everything is concrete down here. Look at this. It goes off in every direction. Wow. Oh, okay, fair enough, a little cut out there, so there are things on the ceiling here. Uh, what would they have been for, I wonder? Uh, for lighting, I'm guessing. There we go, let's keep going. Wow, this is great. Yeah, the last time I know people were down here were about eight years ago, so it's, it's quite nice to be able to tick this one off the list. What have we got? Rolls of carpet. Old, old tin. What's this we got? Okay. So it sounds like the guys have gone that way. What's that? Oh, look, we're going to have to have a climb. There's a hole in the top of the wall. So let's go. Let's keep going. No signs of graffiti yet, but I will do another sweep before we leave. Uh, another cut out. What's this on the floor? God. Uh, some of the other electrical boxes. Very nice. Again, there's not much going on there. There's, there is writing on the wall, but you can't really make it out. Oh, actually, you can see it better on the camera than you can actually in knackers. Okay. We do have original wooden frame here. And, oh, right, okay. Got a few bits in here. A few tins and light shades. Yeah, let's turn around a second. Old shovel head. Okay. Oh, <laughs> the door's almost intact. That's good, that is. Yeah. Keep going this way. Catch up with the other guys for a minute. And then we'll photograph. Oh, okay. What's this? Ah, oh, so we've got the bare chalk here for the first time. A lot of the old cable as well. Okay. Ah, okay. So the whole design changes. Wow. Okay. Well, they built this one a bit differently, didn't they? Yeah, they did. Well, check this out. I see there's a little climb for a wall around the next turn, isn't there? That's right, yeah. yeah. Well, there's, there's another one down that way as well, it goes over. Oh, is it going? Yeah. Yeah. We found a toilet! Yeah. <laughs> hey! Two of them for you. Oh, wow. Oh, look. So, not only do we have the cars, eh? Hold on, let me see if I can focus in on this. Got some old. Uh, getting closer, camera. Nope. Wow, okay. Brilliant. Oh, right, okay, so we've got. Uh, okay, so it goes through here. We're going to have to try and go through there in a bit. Um, let's come. Oh, whoa! Hold on. There's some numbers and stuff. It's 
scribbled into the walls here. A lot of numbers. Okay. A couple of little pencil sketches. Oh, it's a bird's head. Hold on. Yeah, look. It's like a pigeon or a seagull's head, sorry. Excellent. Okay. Right. Let's keep going then. Might photograph it. Oh, this is oh, this has been bricked off. So maybe another original way in. Whoa. Okay. I didn't expect that. Right, let's do a photo. Let's get the photos done. We need to do the photos as well as everything else. Uh, let's get the photos done. Let's continue on back to that section that we saw a moment ago. So yeah, this was a public ARP shelter. Um, if I'm honest, I don't know what the capacity of this one was, but so far, we've only covered about maybe a third. It's quite large, so, right. Wow, you can hear, you can hear that it's raining outside quite a lot. Very heavy. Very, very heavy. Fellas. Fellas. Which way have you gone? I went back on this way because I had something to do. Oh, fair enough. Have the guys gone through the hole? The guys have gone through the hole, yeah. Okay, fair play. They won't get very far. I'll get popped off to the red. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh yeah, no, I know about that. Right, okay. So we've got to go through here now. Uh, let's have a quick look through and see what's there first. Oh, God. Okay, I don't have my GoPro with me, so I'm not going to be able to record going over this, but it looks like the rubble goes for quite some way. Oh, let's go. Oh. Right, hopefully that'll give you some perspective how far that rubbish goes. Uh, just managed to climb through. So now we're going to make our way into the tunnels. Uh, it looks like it's been, it's been used as storage down here for the shops above. Uh, there's a lot of old, old gear down here, don't know. <laughs> a lot of old sinks and fireplaces. Uh, Little cut out here. Oh, it's just been filled full of rubbish though, it's a real shame. Uh, Mike and Alan have already told me <coughs> that's just bricked down there, which is unfortunate. So it was a long climb just to uh, get over that. But uh, yeah, let's head back, have a little climb. Oh, that took it. Oh, look at the mould on that. Sure, that's mouldy. Right, let's jump back over. There's always a shopping trolley. So let's return to this bit. So there's a hole here and a board in front of it. So we need to find out what's through there. So let's go. Let's go beyond the board and have a look. Come on then. Get in, Sam. Yeah. Get in. Hold, hold these torches. Come on, then. Oh, there's a trench the other side, that's why. Yeah. Uh, uh, through the hole. <coughs> one hand, one foot. Oh, okay, there's a moving door. Okay. Hang on, hang on. Oh, uh, okay, so this would have been another original entrance. Mike, Mike. Do not go up. Thank you. No. Uh, yeah, that's what it looks like. There's mo no, there's uh Oh well, to be fair, that's thing in it. Let's go this way first. All I'm saying is, one of the one of these goes up to a shop, mate. So I wouldn't go into the shop just in case it's alarmed. Yeah. Is there anything through that door? Mm, have a look. It's solid, mate. Yeah. All right, fair play. 
Well, let's have a let's have a quick look through this one here with a horseshoe on it. <laughs> Let's do it. But if it goes upstairs, I'd avoid it because this yeah, could go up, up into a shop. Stairs, yeah. yeah, this yeah. could go up into what a shop. So we we'll go in. Um, oh, shit. But be careful. Don't try and trip me wrong. Whoa. Who's going to reception? Uh, that's um, that's, that's, stri that's street level, mate. I wouldn't. They see torches shining in there with. Yeah. Yeah. I'd I'd come out of that one. Yep. Yep. <laughs> right. Well, that's it then. Let's uh yeah. Oh. yeah, let's get some photos done. Okay, so we're just gonna head back now on our way out. I said if we spot anything else on our way, but uh, I do believe that's it. So a relatively small ARP shelter in all honesty, but still an interesting one. There's still the original bits down here as well. Like these pots and stuff. There. Quite a bit going on. So yeah, let's uh, take a couple of photos, shall we? So that's it for this one. Um, a big thanks to Mike and the guys over at Hidden History for helping to make this happen. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.